When I first met the bishop, uh, we talked a lot about uh, Christianity, and he was certainly open to all, uh, most of the denominations, and especially the Lutheran group. And then we became co-chair of the Lutheran Roman Catholic Dialogues. It was for priests and Lutheran pastors, but we decided to open it to all, all people. And uh, he brought Cardinal Cassidy from the Vatican, who I think was number three at that point in time. And uh, he spoke uh, out at Concordia Seminary. And uh, that was a great night. And we, uh, we talked, I think, into, into the long hours of the night. We met for, I think, about three or four years and uh, had uh, good experiences there. I invited him to uh, exchange pulpits with me, and he readily did that. Vince LaBarbera said, oh, I don't think he would do that. Well, I said he did. <laughs> I think our people here at Trinity learned more about Martin Luther <laughs> than any, any time before that. But he knew where he was, and he talked about Martin Luther. He held to his beliefs. He was strong about that, but uh, he was open to the expressions of Christianity. And I think he had a fondness for this uh, church, uh, uh, the structure in itself, as well as uh, what we believed. Then at one time, he said, I'd like for you to meet someone. And he took me and we met Mother Teresa. That's probably one of the high points of my life. <laughs> uh, told him about my brother-in-law, who was the editor of the Boston Globe, who called uh, Bishop Darcy the hero of Boston Catholicism. We won't go into all of those stories, but uh, uh, he thought very highly of him, and uh, in fact, I talked to uh, Tim Leland, the editor, and uh, not too long ago, and Bishop Darcy wanted him to come out and, and have lunch with him or dinner with him sometime, but that wasn't to be. We had a good friendship. I had dinner with him uh, before Christmas, and we talked about uh, what we needed to do uh, as well as what we had done. I think a lot of people will remember of how uh, cordial he was to everyone. He was very open to them, and I think there was an affinity that a lot of people uh, felt with him because he was so open. Maybe it was that Irish personality, I don't know, that the people just thought he, not only that he was bishop, but that he was a friend. Maybe that says it best.